Alex, a new contract at the Saints, was it a hard decision to make? No, I don't think it was at all. Um, you know, a family around here, I've, I've played here for the last four or five years and I think, you know, I've developed as a player here and I, I want to keep developing and, and hopefully I can do that with the, the coaches and, and the setup as it is. You're the only player to have featured in every game for the last season and a half. Does that give you a sense of pride? It does, yeah. I mean, there are occasional few five minutes here, ten minutes there. But I think, you know, if I'm just doing my bit, help the boys out. If I'm starting or if I'm on the bench, then I'll do that. Um, so hopefully, you know, it, it long continues. What's been the highlight of your time at the club so far? I think the highlight well, and the low light was probably the uh, Heineken final. Being involved in that. Obviously, it would have been nicer if we'd uh, won it. But uh, obviously, for me, uh, you know, 21 to be playing in the Heineken Cup final in front of you know 75,000 people was, was a massive achievement and something that I'll never forget. You know, I've, I've played more than I thought I would, um, you know, especially last season. Um, but now, hopefully, I've become a bit of an established member of the squad and I can keep on uh, pushing for that starting spot. Does it matter a bit more to you uh, to play for the first team having come through the senior academy? I think so, yeah. I think it means a lot to everyone who plays for the, uh, for the first team, uh, whether you've come through the academy or not. But yeah, I think it has a little extra something because you mean you've worked your way up through the ranks and, and you're playing along the boys that you looked up to when you were a young kid and, and now you're your teammates. It's certainly you know, an exciting time for the squad. We've had um, you know, some of the younger guys re-signing as well and I think everyone's just looking forward to the rest of the season and uh, pushing on and hopefully... Um, achieving as, as well as we can. Yeah. Um, slightly frustrating just hearing from, from Dorian, you know, you had a great start, a bit of an injury setback. I mean, I suppose that's the, the swings and arrows of, of a typical season for a prop. Yeah, I mean, it, the last place you want to be is sitting on a physio bed when everyone's out there playing. But um, I think certainly from a positive point of view, my calf's better and uh, and fortunately for me, I'm back in the squad playing. So, so no, it's, it's, been a, it's been a good couple of weeks and uh, no, just, yeah, like I say, looking forward to the weekend. And from a long-term point of view, with the departures of, of, of you know, Brian and, and Suani, it gives you a massive opportunity to nail the starting jersey at Saints, which should be a, a great opportunity for you. Yeah, I mean, you, you, you've just got to look at the club and the history of, of Northampton, and we're always going to have strong positions in, in, the, in, in the front row, so and strong players. So I think uh, to focus too much on those two guys leaving, you know, would would do an injustice to the rest of the squad so I think we've just got to realise that there's always going to be strong players there and you know you, you've just got to do your best when you are selected.